TB10 team, how you guys doing this evening? Right now I'm hopping in the car, heading my wife up for lunch. Um, yeah, my wife is definitely loving this. The days that I'm off, I take her in to work in the morning. Um, I meet her for lunch at lunchtime and, uh, and I also pick her up. So she gets a little spoiled treatment on my days off. So I don't mind doing it because uh, our schedules are pretty slam tight during the week um so anytime i get off to be with my wife and spend some time with her I definitely take advantage of that so heading over to pick her up uh as you can see the weather is kind of gloomy today it's a little grayish um but the sun's trying to peek through um that's just like texas weather i'm sure you guys have heard on like all three of our vlogs episodes that um Texas weather is like this. One day it's summertime weather, one time it's spring, and another time it's winter. And so yeah, today is like a winter day. It's 38 degrees. Um, yeah, it's not too warm today, so I'm kind of bundled up. Um, anyway, yeah, I hope you guys been enjoying our vlog episodes. I've been trying to be diligent about putting uh, episodes up pretty frequently. Um, just want to shout out to Pastor Brian Meadows, it was amazing yesterday at uh, the Potter's House, North Dallas. Um, yeah, we got some clips of that. But yeah, man, really blessed us. Definitely a powerful message. It was entitled God's Economy. Um, so yeah, definitely check that out. Um, had a good time there. And then we uh, tried out this Mexican restaurant after that called The Blue Goose cantina um and it was okay it wasn't nothing spectacular um someone from my job recommended it uh, just like your normal uh, mexican restaurant uh, but it, it was cool it's nice to get out and try something different but today i'm not sure where we're gonna go for lunch uh, usually we just go somewhere pretty fast uh, my wife only gets like an hour to uh eat lunch so i'm not gonna go too far away from her job so we'll probably just grab something fast food eat it and uh i'll get it back to work so other than that just a normal day off i'm gonna try to definitely catch up on some rest and um do some editing of our vlogs um, just to make sure i keep them coming hot for you guys uh, we appreciate everyone subscribing uh, we appreciate everyone liking and viewing our vlogs definitely means a lot to us um we just want to share our experience here in uh, Dallas, Texas. So yeah, we're gonna spice it up a little bit. We'll have some uh, challenges. Uh, we'll do some contests uh, for our subscribers in the future. So um, definitely wanna make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out on any of those contests and giveaways that we have um, in the future. So and definitely we'll do some fun things here on our channel as we're just getting started. But anyway, I'll catch up with you guys uh, after I pick my wife up. Hi y'all, welcome to Trey and Boobie's channel. How what you guys doing? Up? Okay, so right here we got these kind of like protein health type of section here, which is really cool, I think. Got all of this kind of stuff. He's really well organized, this target is really nice. Really awesome. And then we getting into the home section right here but before that, I just want to go ahead and show these mannequins here they look really cute I like this outfit look at that how cute is that yeah and here is the home section she looks pretty cool I mean, that's really cute over there also we got here really cute uh-huh got so much to choose so here is the Clarence Frag. Some nice sweaters right there. Yeah, so here it is like 
the fitness gym clothing. Oh, got some cute things though. Some cute bras. This is pretty cute. Yeah, that's cute. Some nice leggings. Yeah, I like Target collection. They got cute things and over there also nice colors. Really cute. Summer season as fast as possible. Oh, that is cute. I love. I'm like a big kid. I just love it. Oh, look at Mini. The paw control. This is cute. Oh, but this is really nice. Look at that. Yeah, I like How cool is that? Oh, and that's by the couple that we watch on TV yeah, all the time. They're in Fort Worth. Yeah, they're in Fort Worth. Yeah. So you actually can step in. And they have like this nice display here. Yeah, this target is really cool though. We need a welcome Yeah, oh look at those pillows. Wow, I love it. Heart shape and they got a lot of bling bling. So cute. It's pretty nice. Mm -hmm. You know, you can find a little bit of everything in Target. And the playlist jamming too. They got Mary J jumping. Yeah, right? If I was working here, I'd be. Show me a little bit to step. Come on. Go ahead. <laughs> well done. Go, booty. Go, booty. I'm going to have to work here. I Show can, me what you got. I'll be jamming, doing all the inventory. Oh, I need to get me a floss, a water floss. That's exactly what I want. This is what our next big thing will be. I like this. And some, this is uh, like a good one, actually. Some meal prep with this here. We got kind of cool Instapot. Make a yeah. Lot of types of that is good. Yeah. And you can leave it on. Yeah, so here are the TVs and all of the electronics there. Oh, let's check the cameras out. We want to buy a nice camera, don't we? Yeah, let's we just see by curiosity. We oh, and yeah. we want a Nintendo. What is a Nintendo that's XR? A Kindle. Kindle. No, I'm saying we, we want a Nintendo. I know that's a Kindle. Switch. That's a big prize for Christmas for me. Next year. Oh, look at that. Those are good. Mm -hmm. yeah, they don't sell for the 100, well, pretty 100. much. Yeah. No, 100 bucks less almost. We got this one for 400 there. Mm -hmm. And this one for 300, but I don't know. This is what we got. Oh, look at it. This is what we got. 200 bucks. Oh, one of those, yeah. yeah. That's probably what we need, right? Mm hmm. Panasonic. Here it is. Hmm. I'm filming you. Hey. Can you see me? Yeah, you're looking pretty good, too. Of course. I always look good. What are you talking about? Like what, 200 bucks mm -hmm. for that one? Yeah. Good price though. 2.2 .2 megapixels. The megapixels is not that good though. Mm, that's probably why. Now you jump up to here at 179. Yeah, no, that's what I was telling you. 16 megapixels. Oh, nice. I don't know. I think it seems like that one will be easier to kind of grab yeah, and it stuff. Be nice. Hey, how you are? Yeah, they got some good cameras. Look at now. This one is probably the best. Look at that. Oh yeah, of course. Look. But you can buy attachments for that Sony to make it like zoom that. In. But obviously, no. Oh, you actually, buy the eye. No. Oh, that's exactly how it is, right? Mm-hmm. Cool. It's kind of cool to have. Right? Mm-hmm. Even though I prefer more Xbox related, but this would be kind of Fortnite. So yeah, we got a few big options here. Just got so much here. What is it? Oh, that is cute! It's like a retro... Um, Arcades, I believe. Arcade. Yeah. Yeah, Pac Man, that's the. He's cute, Pac Man. Classic. And this too. This is like the old school PlayStation. Like mm. the very first one. Look, Dre. That's cute. Oh, yeah, it's still a ro robot. Yeah. Can, can do things with it. Cosmo. How mm -hmm. awesome is that? Mm hmm. And 
Look this at pretty cute. Oh, look at that. Harry Potter. Oh, it's like a little drawing pad. And you can make your own. Mm. Hello! What's up, what's up, what's up, YouTube? How you doing? TV 10, family, TV team, team, <laughs> trade movie, team. How y'all doing? We back at it. We're back here at home now. Finally got all comfortable and relaxed from work. I was off today. My wife had to work. Um, so now we're back home and we thought we'd do something different. Um, it's a trivia game. So we like to challenge each other. So remember when I was saying I have something really excited coming up. So this is what it is. I came with this idea. Let's play a game and then we each one of us will have five questions that we don't have any idea. Each, each one of us pick five different questions. Answers the question wrongly. I get to get them wet and vice versa. You get to get me wet too. So that's really exciting. That's why I'm using this little thing because I really don't want to mess my hair up. So here and we go. And as you see, I don't have anything on. So I'm planning, <laughs> planning on not to get wet. So pretty good at trivia. So hopefully I won't get splashed. All right. So third person. You so. know what? It's fine. I can go first. All right. Uh, All right. Go ahead and choose your question. I got my questions here. Okay. All right, family. You too, family. <laughs> okay. So they okay. go this way. So what two colors mixed together makes the color purple? I would say red and brown. <laughs> Ah, uh, <laughs> one part right. So the answer is actually red and blue. Oh, so would you speak like a warm little water? warm water? Or oh, cold water? Warm. So that's the cold water. So here's the warm water. Okay. So I'll give it the benefit of Don't this. wet. I'll make it warm water. Here we go. <laughs> Here we go. So we have the contents of the that's water. That's okay. Water. That's too much. That's too much. I got half of the question right. See, she's changing the rules already. No, 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 no. I'm not changing the rules. Wait, don't let my question get wet. So the water is going to be filled. <laughs> ah, okay. And, so, and the, the thing is, we cannot move. Okay. I love it. So there we go, YouTube family. He's so lucky that we play this stupid game. Either way, I will. <laughs> yeah. That's pretty good. Uh, it's cool. <laughs> All right, my turn. All right, so which one? Yeah, it's cold. Cold. <laughs> which one? Pick All pick? right, so I'm going to pick question number two. Three. Okay, so question number two. Okay, so here it is. How old will be Marilyn Monroe if she was still alive? What kind of question? <laughs> is well, this that? is the question. See, here we go. I don't even complain about this question, but it I did is. general trivia. It doesn't questions matter. It's a question. So. If she was living today, let me think. What do I know about Marilyn Monroe? Bum. Bum. She was around the age of John F. Kennedy. John F. Kennedy. I would say she would be probably 84. Wrong! That means you're getting wet. So what's the answer? She will be 93. 93. <laughs> so you want cold or warm? Warm, I already have more. Not too warm, not hot. Yeah, not, not hot. You, you ready? You ready? You ready? You cannot move. Take your questions away. Uh, right. 
I swear we can get through these. Hopefully one of us <laughs> will get I swear you can get through a these. question. Right? I All think right, this is funny. Okay, I'll take this one. Okay. Should be, should be pretty good. Should be easy, actually. Let's see where her geographical knowledge is. Uh, look at him talking trash already. So, how many countries make up the continent of Europe? Come on. So that's a pretty fair question. I would say, and that's just like thinking. Go ahead and fill it up. No, just make sure it's warm. Yeah. It's too cold for that. Um, yeah, just kind of like guessing. I will say 34. You're right, baby. Psych! <laughs> Wait, Nick. How many you had to say? So it's 50. Dag on, dag it. Here we go. Ready? One, two, three. Wait, <laughs> you cannot come that close. <laughs> you cannot come that close. Okay, here we go. All right. Stay on your place and throw it right here. Well, that was better. That was actually warm. I like that temperature. All okay. right. I'm next. Second round for you. <laughs> no, boy. I'll go ahead and choose question number one. On okay. Top. Number one. Yes. Where was the sauna invented? The sauna was invented in the country, I would say, Turkey. <laughs> oh, it was, was it? in Finland. Yeah. See, ready? Mm -hmm. I don't got you too much water. Uh, it's a little bit more than what I did. That's okay. No, he's not. Look like at him trying to bark his way through. No, you cannot know when he's coming. Come on. Because it's more cute. Come on. Okay. It's fine. <laughs> you gotta say one, two, three. That's the thing. Go, guys. One, two. <laughs> I totally missed it. This one should be pretty easy. I yeah, think. all of his questions should be pretty easy, but. I should get this one. If you don't get this one, then. Uh, yeah, why you never got one of mine? Take but he always history, make a scene class that. One -on -one. Whatever. She Whatever. Doesn't get, she doesn't get this then. Whatever. Wet face. Look Which at you. Which Italian city is known as the city of water? The city of water? Yes. Think. Think. Like you will know without Googling. I'm not even that. sorry. Yeah, That's yeah, very yeah. Easy. We're sitting the only one I knew before that Google was where the sauna was in which country. I knew that. Now, where the what? <laughs> I knew it. And I'm serious. Which uh, Italian city is known as the water city? Oh, Venice? Yes. All right. right. Ooh, look at me. Look at me. Go Ruth, go Ruth, go Ruth, go Ruth. College okay, this one classes. should be easy. E, play basketball. E, graduate sports management. So I'm sure he had anatomy in his classes. Mm, so what's the smallest muscle in the body? Me uh, what? Your neck muscle? Oh my good he well, with, where is No, it? the ear. That's a muscle? Or yes, no? no, it's a muscle. So which you call stapedius muscle in the tympanic cavity. Last question for for you. Which Come is the on. largest ocean? Come on. So I think it's actually the Pacific. <laughs> Look at me! Okay. How many countries exist in Africa continent? That's a good question. Okay. Keep counting the I countries. I actually just estimate in Europe, but I have never no idea. Um, 
All right, I'm gonna guess. I got 14 that I know off the top of my head, but I know it's probably some smaller countries that I don't know about. Got Bernie, that's 15. I'm gonna say 20. 20 countries in continent Africa. 54. What's up, TB10 team? How you guys doing? Finally coming in the end to vlog episode four. I uh, just want to leave you guys with some words of wisdom. Once again, thank you guys for following our page. Please make sure you are subscribing. Make sure you give us a like as well. Um, my wife is currently sleeping a little bit. But like I said, guys, thank you for following us. Thank you for giving you us your time and sharing a little part of our world. Um, and like I said, please make sure you subscribe. Um, so my quote for today to end this vlog is, success isn't about how much money you make. It's about the difference you make in people's lives. Um, so that quote is, um, or was made by Michelle Obama. Um, shouts out to the Obamas, uh, but definitely true, true there for sure. Um, if you're measuring your success by how much money you're making, you're sadly mistaken. Um, success comes from the difference you make in other people's lives. Um, so think about that as you're heading into work tomorrow, um, school or whatever it may be. Um, your success is not measured by how much your paycheck is, but the difference you make in other people's lives. Um, so make sure you value your time and your knowledge that you're giving to someone. Um, because it can go a long way further than money can. Um, once again, thank you for following us and we look forward to seeing you guys in our next episode. Good night.